Hi, my name is Sonia and I work in the marketing department at Riding Warehouse. And I'm Katie and I work in web content and today we're going to give you a closer look at a few new breaches we just brought into Riding Warehouse. So Sonia, can you tell me which breaches you're wearing today? Yeah, definitely. I'm wearing the Kingsland Cotty E-Tech breaches. Mm -hmm. I picked them out because I was initially really impressed by how stretchy they were. And mm -hmm. I've personally never tried a silicone dot full seat breach, so I was really curious to give it a go. Nice. So can you tell me um, a few of your initial thoughts when you first put those breaches on? So when I first pull my breeches on, I can know right away if I'm gonna want them or not. Mm -hmm. And initially, the first thing that really stood out for me is how comfortable they were. They have this really nice four-way stretch fabric and it really just doesn't restrict any movement whatsoever. I also love the higher waistband. I think it's really flattering. And especially when you sit in the saddle, it just makes for a really nice figure. So those were some of my favorite things overall about the breeches. What about you? What do you have on? So I have the Montar Aura breeches on and um, I, I absolutely love them. They're actually a boot cut breech and what I really thought was interesting is I've never owned a boot, boot cut breech before but I was able to tuck them right into my tall boots and slide them right up and they're super comfortable. And then what's nice is that I can take my tall boots off and I've got more of a casual look so I can go run errands around town or you know just do some barn chores. Um, another thing I really loved about these breeches was the material. They're really stretchy, super breathable, um, it's supposed to be extremely moisture wicking so I know long hours in the saddle, I'm going to be totally comfortable. And lastly, um, these also have a silicone full seat, which I've had some limited experience myself with them, but um, just from my initial thoughts, super comfortable, not bulky, um, just really the perfect breach for all around wear. So one thing that's really important when you buy a breach is how does it actually fit and you know, ride in when you're in the saddle. And for me, that's what makes or breaks a breach. And we actually had the opportunity to ride a horse and, and see how they, you know, see if they met our expectations. So what did you think of your Montar boot cuts? So I really loved them. Um, the silicone full seat, I feel like I'm just getting more and more of a fan of this particular print because it's so sticky. And I just feel like I'm so secure in the saddle and I just, I really love it. Um, I thought maybe the boot cut might switch around that cut in my tall boot. It didn't, it stayed really nice and smooth. And so I just felt like there was no bulk in there at all. And um, for the stretch and factors that I was telling about earlier, super stretchy. I was able to move around from the walk, trot, canter, and um, I would really suggest these to just about anyone who wanted to go trail riding to, you know, eventing. They could do anything in them. Awesome. So can you tell me a little bit of um, your thoughts when you were riding in the Kingsland breeches? Yeah, for sure. So as I said, when I first pulled them on, I was super impressed. I was pretty much sold right there, but how did they actually work when I was in the saddle? Again, totally met my expectations. They're absolutely no restriction of movement which you know when you're jumping out on cross country flat work is super important mm -hmm. I really liked how the high waistband fit in the saddle I thought it might get away a little bit and come too high but it stayed right there at the perfect spot and as for the silicone again as I mentioned this is my first go at silicone breaches yeah. but it, as you mentioned I'm I'm starting to become a believer in them so I, I would highly recommend these breeches as well. You have two breeches that are at a pretty similar price point, kind of different features for each, but both overall, I mean, I'm personally, I'm gonna buy these breeches, so <laughs> I don't know about you. I don't know, these might have to go on my wish list. <laughs> The Kingsland and Montar brand may not be super well known yet, but based on both of our experiences in the saddle with these breeches, we strongly recommend you check them out at ridingwarehouse.com. 